Welcome to Runway Academy. Today, we're using Gen 3 Alpha to blend live action video with generated visual effects. Generating your own visual effects is an extremely powerful workflow, and it's probably easier than you think. Step number one is gonna be sourcing or shooting the source video. Make sure that you have an idea in mind when shooting your video. For this example, we're gonna make this plant rapidly grow after being watered. When shooting your own clips, make sure your camera's autofocus and auto white balance are turned off, which can mess up the final composite of your video clip. Additionally, shooting on a tripod is also helpful if you don't wanna do any extra motion tracking. Once you've shot your video, scrub through the footage and export a still frame from the video where you want to apply the visual effects. Then bring that image into Gen3 Alpha. Depending on your idea, you can use the first frame function, which will pass the image as frame one of your video, or the last frame function, which will pass the image as the final frame of your video. For this, we'll use the first frame and prompt for a static shot of a potted plant inside of a modern living space. The plant transforms into a taller plant as the camera remains in a static wide shot. Once you have an output that you like, it's time to composite it back into the original video. Compositing in its most simplified definition is combining two or more images together to make one final image, or in this case, a video. On the left, we have the original video clip, and on the right, we have the generated video clip, which both come together to form the final video composite. For the final output, feel free to tweak color correction or masking if needed, or add any additional effects on top to bring your vision to life. Gen3 Alpha Image to Video allows you to achieve various levels of visual effects, from singular assets to fully blended live action and generated content. For more helpful tips and tricks, make sure to check out the Gen3 Alpha help article or join our community on Discord to see how other creatives are leveraging Gen3 Alpha in their workflows. If you have a specific question, you could always use this button on your dashboard at any time.